Hello. I would like to compare for you two lasers. One is 20 watts Naya, and the second one is a 15 watts Chinese laser. And uh, in my opinion, they are both same. The shape of the beam is very similar. However, the Naya you can focus to this size is the angled one the bottom one is 15 watts Chinese one however the Chinese one you can focus right to the point which is sometimes nice if you want to make something not just cutting but maybe some light show or something I wouldn't recommend it because it's way too powerful of course always wear the safety glasses and uh, what else I can say uh, they both seem to have the same power and I try to focus them uh, on the edge of the table so we can compare how they are piercing through the 2 millimeter thick paper and as you see they are pretty much the same It seems to be like Naya is doing this faster, but I just played with the focus a little bit and I probably just set it out of focus. And yep, pretty much the same. They're both cutting it really well, no problem with that. The thick paper like some for some cards or something is just going really nice and easy um, the Chinese one came with the controller that is pretty big and is uh, have nice little feature that allows you to turn the power down to the focusing mode where Naya doesn't have that but on the other hand, Naya have all the electronics in itself. So there is no extra board that you need to install in the machine. You might need longer wire or something. Naya doesn't need that. And uh, what I like about the Chinese one is really quiet. In compare, if I turn off the Naya, you can't even hear it really where the Nea is really loud but have much better cooling ability but Chinese doesn't seem to get hot either so it's like they're at the same temperature um, if you'd like to know something else just let me know in the comments uh, what I can say about this from the practical way uh, when I bought it uh, Naya is just a module that I bought for 86, 87 pounds from eBay and the Chinese module uh, was cheaper when I bought it was 70 few pounds now it, now it gets more expensive uh, however it comes with the power supply and the plug and everything Naya is just a module that you probably should just connect to the as an upgrade so be aware of that and uh, um, they are both uh, the PWM signal that you can uh, use to control the power of the um, lasers uh, they are both working the same it is not like TTL signal is actually more suitable for uh, PWM where uh, all it needs is just uh, connecting it to the ground to switch it off so it's like uh, NPN transistor inside so all you need to do is just connect it to the ground and it's switching it off so basically, when you're connecting it to the controller, controller is uh, pulling it down to the ground, and this way is switching it off and on. And this uh, width 
of the pulse is modulating the power of it. And uh, on the website, on the eBay, you can see that it says uh, that the PWM is actually uh, 12 volts, but it actually turns it on when it goes over the five uh, over the 4.5 volts. So anything above the four and a half volts is gonna switch it on, and connecting to the ground is gonna switch it off. So it's it's quite easy to connect it. It's nothing special. However, not everything what they say on the website is true. Okay, if you need to know something else, just let me know in the comments, I'll try to answer it. And stay safe with the safety goggles on.